Hello, everyone. I have COVID. No! God, please, no! 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 This is an update video, though. This is the, the only, only Pixar, Pixar tier, tier list, list that, that truly matters, matters that you will ever watch. watch. In my time in quarantine, I saw two Pixar tier lists. Both of them had outrageous rankings. One of them was Film Observer. Highly doubt you'll see this, but if you do, I don't, I don't agree with anything, anything you say. <laughs> and Beth, if you see this, you had a bug's life in a very interesting spot. That's all I'll say about that one. Regularly scheduled program videos will come again when I feel better. But for now, we got this tier list of every Pixar movie because I don't have the energy to do anything that crazy or dedicate time to a gameplay or anything like that. As you can see, we have our categories. We have again, again. Obviously, that's the best. Like, I'm watching that again. Play that right now. I got, I'd watch it again. I mean, I'd watch it, but I don't want to do that right now. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's all right. Like, that speaks for itself. Meh. I mean, it's good. I wouldn't watch it again, probably. All those Z's, because that movie's going to put me to sleep. <laughs> Our last one is me and Elastigirl are watching this on our honeymoon. Why is watching in parentheses? Cause that movie is so bad, it's gonna be background noise, you know what I'm saying? Oh! Ew! We're gonna get started with A Bug's Life. Beautiful way to start this, cause it's going right in the mean last girl watching this on honeymoon. I think for the time that it came out, it was probably super good. But if you compare that to any of these other movies, it is not nearly as entertaining. We got Brave next. I'm gonna chuck Brave at meh. It's not the worst Pixar movie. Not the best one either though. I'd watch it over a bug's life because that movie is I don't know what I was about to say, but yeah. Cars. I don't love this franchise, is the thing. But I will say the first movie had a great foundation of what could have been. So I'll say it's alright. I feel like they try to innovate too much with the second and third one, which brings me to the second and the third one. Second one that's a honeymoon movie. I think the fact that it's a spy themed orientation is really cool. So you know what, for that fact, I feel like I'd tune in a little bit. So I'll say it's meh. I know, I know, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy, it's crazy. I mean, it's not a bad movie to me. It's just not the worst, or it's not the best movie either. You know what I'm saying? So, you gotta have meh. And then we got Cars 3. I would fall asleep to this movie. If I need a movie to fall asleep to, it'd be this one. Me and my sister watched it, and we were laughing the whole time. If anything, it should have been a comedy. If this was a comedy tier list, it'd be up here with a get in again. Coco. I didn't love Coco. It's not a bad movie. I'd say it's pretty bad. Finding Nemo. Ooh. Oh, I said Tuffy right there. I said Tuffy. I'm gonna have to get Finding Nemo. I'm gonna have to put that out and watch it again. I've already seen it multiple times. If I can't put it out again and again, I lie because I'm going to. Again and again, when we play that movie, I'm going to eat it again. Uh, Finding Dory. I actually liked it a lot. So I'm gonna chuck it at meh. But I'm actually gonna put it at, I mean, it's all right because I didn't love, I didn't hate it. I didn't hate that movie at all. Miss it out, I'd watch it again. Ooh, you know what's funny about Luca? I still haven't seen it. I've been meaning to see it, but I've only heard good things. So for that reason alone, I gotta put it and it's all right. And that's where I'll stand with that. Monsters Inc. Uh, I'd watch it again. Monster University, though. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the nap. Onward. Hey, we needed something to put on in the background anyway, so that's fine. I feel like that movie was trying to be something that it just was not. It was all right for what it was. The tearjerker moment in that movie that all Pixar movies have, let's be real. I feel like the payoff for it was the most lame. Ratatouille. It's all right. I think if they made a sequel to this called like Ratatouille. Soul. Uh. Eh. I hated it. Go ahead. Thank you for the. Thank you for the nap though. I appreciate the good dinosaur. Never seen it. Only heard bad things though. So I'm gonna check it out. Meh. The Incredibles one gets put into again and again. Incredibles two gets put onto again and again. And there's no question about that because those movies are perfect and flawless. And I don't want to hear anybody else listen and put on it because it doesn't matter. Those movies are flawless. Turning Red, I actually loved it. I loved it so much. It made me cry. So I'm gonna check it in 
I'd watch it again. It's nice watching a movie that you can relate to, you know? Toy Story, a uh, lot better than the second one. I'm gonna say it's all right. Good foundation. I'll actually put it above card. Toy Story 2? Put that in again and again. Run it back. That movie is flawless. That movie's flawless. The scene where he's sewing Woody back together, I know it's like a uh, cliche to say that's my favorite part, but it's, and the whole arc with Buzz, I love to introduce the introduction of Jesse and freaking, uh, I can't think of the horse's name. The horse's name, Kendall, right there. If you, please, please Kendall, just put the name right here. I know I ask a lot of you, and I know you don't feel that great. Unless you're in the future and you feel better, just put the horse's name in there. I'm, I'm, I'm struggling. I'm struggling. I can't even get a sentence out. You see, I'm, 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 I'm up. Help me out. Just put the horse's name. Thank you. Is that someone to ask? Toy Story 3. I'm gonna put it in and watch it again. This is pretty good. It's not better than Toy Story 2, but it is better than Toy Story 1. Toy Story 4. It's not better than Toy Story 4. Three, but it is better than Toy Story 4, so I'm gonna put it at all right, but the top of it's all right, you know? We got up, it's meh, okay? Let me tell you why it's meh. You may be like, whoa! Whoa, but the old man in the balloon in the beginning! You only like that movie for the first 10 minutes. The first 10 minutes are really good, really solid, great music. The fact that they can tell a whole story without saying a single word, that's awesome, I love that. But you don't watch past the first like 15, 20 minutes. Let's be real, every time you rewatch it, you get to that part to feel something and then you turn it off. So that's why it's going to me. Wally. I believe this was the first Pixar movie I actually saw in theaters. And for the nostalgia factor, I'm gonna have to put it at It's All Right. But I'll put it higher than all these movies. Last but not least, we got Lightyear. Man, I liked this movie a lot when I watched it, okay? I liked it a lot. If I was a kid and that was like my movie, and I was like, dang, I want, I would get that toy when it comes out. Now this is like kid mentality because I don't, I don't use toys as an adult. Okay. I do have this. I'm outing myself. I got a build a bear. Okay, I was a child. And I'm never getting rid of this. This isn't a toy though. This is an extension of my well-being. Why am I bringing this up? Because there's a difference. See you, Ghosty. Anyway, light year. I'm gonna chuck that at, I'd watch it again. Very, very good movie. And this is my tier list. It looks kind of like a middle finger, but with an extra thingy happening at the bottom. Let me make an adjustment to this real quick. Okay, this looks more like mm, a solid list. If you're trying to figure out what Pixar movies to watch in what order, this is what you wanna do. This will get you the most entertainment of your life if you choose this exact order. Any other tier list, any other ranking, any other video that you see that has Pixar movies ranked in a tier or listed from like 30 to whatever, just disregard those, cause this, this is definitive. On that beautiful, beautiful note, we're gonna end the video then. Again, this is the only list that matters. If I find out you have another person to go to for recommendations, I am gonna feel hurt by that. I already have my Marvel tier list, and look, that was flawless also. And we got another flawless tier list. Come on, man. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to slap the like button, tell your friends to subscribe, and Dead by Daylight is coming on Friday, so. Up, see you there. Give me a call, we can watch the stars tonight. I never knew that I couldn't get it right. Look in my eyes, do you think I died tonight? Always I'm left by myself, I'm not alright. I can check my phone, let I get a text from you.